Hey everybody, it's Giselle. Welcome back to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you guys a very quick and simple morning skincare routine. I know that a lot of people have like super complicated morning routines with like so many products and stuff. I think one or two of these products you guys have already seen in previous videos. So this is more of like an update, but there's been a few new products that I'm literally in love with. So I was like, I need to show them the new skincare products that I've been using because I've been really happy with how my skin has been looking lately. Without further ado, let's begin the skincare routine. I'm gonna be starting off with this Glytone Enhanced Brightening Solution. So this is technically another word for a toner. I've been looking for a really good toner for dark spots. I feel like I've mentioned this in previous videos, but um, whenever I get a pimple, my issue is that I don't get that many pimples, but when I do, like once the pimple heals, it'll be like a little red dot on my face. It just really bothers me because then like a bunch of red dots will like accumulate on my face. And I guess I can kind of get away with it because I have a lot of freckles, but it does kind of bother me, especially like on this side when I get like bigger red dots and stuff like that. Like it's nothing crazy, but it does kind of bother me. You guys already know that I'm in the modeling world, so you know what I'm saying? I'm not trying to have a bunch of red dots on my face. <laughs> I researched a bunch, specifically actually on lovelyskin.com, which is where I found my favorite serum, which we will get to next. I was like, let me go on this website and look for a good toner for getting rid of dark spots or like brightening your face or whatever. I found this one. This one was the one with the best reviews and there's like before and after pictures if you guys want to see. Um, for yourself. This is what I'm going to be using right now. So this one um, specifically, it says for you to like really rub it in for the product to like get in your skin, especially where the red spots are or dark marks, whatever it is. I like really focus on the side of my face where there's the most dark marks. Next, I'm gonna be going in with, like I said, I've mentioned this in previous videos and this is still my number one favorite serum. This is the Brightening V3 Brightening Serum by PCA Skin. You can also buy this on the Lovely Skin website. Um, they always have promo codes there. I know that this is super expensive. It's like, I'm gonna be completely honest, it's like over $100, but you can find promo codes. I've actually never paid 100, like I've never paid the full price for this to be completely honest. Like I'm every single time able to go online and find promo codes and get like $30, $50 off. Technically, yeah, it's very expensive, but every time that I bought this, I can guarantee you, you can find a promo code to get this for like $50. So. Just have to say that because I know a lot of people are gonna be like, oh my god, super expensive. So wow. But like, I'm telling you for a guaranteed, you will find a promo code for um, the Lovely Skin website because I have never paid full price on that website, literally never. <laughs> just have to put that out there. But yeah, so I'm just gonna put this all over my face. Then next, I'm gonna be using, which this actually think is a new product. I don't think I've mentioned this on my channel yet. So this is the Tatcha for Perfecting Sunscreen SPF 35. So I spent a very, very long time looking for a sunscreen that does not leave my face oily because I've had people mention to me before when I've tried using other sunscreens previously, um, people have mentioned to me that my face is looking super oily, like more specifically by the end of the day. Um, so my thing was to find a mattifying sunscreen, which this one is actually also a primer. So this is great, honestly, because I love a mattifying primer. And honestly, the best part is that it doesn't leave your face looking white on top of the fact that it doesn't leave your face looking Oily. Honestly, I have not found a better sunscreen than this when it comes to like aesthetic purposes, but it does have SPF 35, which is pretty good. I mean, you can also reapply it during the day if you want. The last product I'm going to be talking about is this It Cosmetics by My Under Eye Cream. I just personally love this, love this product because it really helps you wake up in the morning or it helps you appear like you're awake in the morning especially if you didn't get enough sleep. So I actually apply a decent amount of this all over my eye. And it really does help. You can go online if you want to the 
Cosmetics website and there are some like incredible before and after pictures. I'm just like super picky when it comes to skincare. Like it's not something that I mind spending money on just because it's your skin. So, and it's your face. And that is it. Very simple, not too many products, but um, all the ones that I did mention are very good. So I'm excited to see if you guys try any of them. Let me know in the comments. Hey everyone, thanks for watching today's video. Don't forget to like this video and leave a comment down below on suggestions for future videos you guys have. Also, don't forget to subscribe and press the bell button so you can get notified every time I post a new video. And of course, don't forget to follow my Instagram, Snapchat, and Twitter. That will all be down below. Bye everybody.